you click the video, and the question you're asking yourself is, should male and female poker players get paid equally? And unless you're a sexist, misogynistic bigot, the answer is yes. But sadly, it isn't even close to the case. Average of top 10 earning women made about 139,000. An average of top 10 earning men made about 3.2 million with an M. This is official data from World Series of Poker for 2015. That is a difference of more than $3 million. Over the course of a working lifetime, a female will lose about $122 million just for the fact that she is a woman. You know what you could buy with that kind of money? That's like a fancy-ass house, a truckload of chocolate bars, or 10. Not 10, but approximately 122 million chocolate bars. But I would do the smart thing and invest in a chocolate manufacturing company so you can get unlimited chocolate bars for the rest of your life. Come with me and you'll be in a world of pure imagination. I am not good at math, y'all, but something here does not add up. No, Lacey, it does add up. If it wasn't for the patriarchy stopping you, you'd have enough money for your very own chocolate factory. And you say you're not good at math, but I do find it rather puzzling that you use a lot of statistics in your videos. You should really leave it to the professionals like me. So I then told my evil, straight white twin brother of my amazing analysis. And then he called me stupid, and that poker is a combination of skill and luck. Nothing to do at all with gender. So at first I told him, You just called my opinion stupid. That's incredibly unproductive. And I don't think I'm going to enact the labor of having to explain to you why that's incredibly offensive and patronizing. And then I redirected the conversation. Not at all because I couldn't address his point, but I needed to address something drastic. And it's strong, independent women don't play poker because nobody encouraged them. Strong, independent women need to be encouraged or they won't do it. But then he tells me that boys didn't get encouraged either, and that maybe boys tend to like it more and play more, so more men do well and make millions of dollars at it. And he also added that men and women are different and like different things, and people shouldn't assume that every high-paying job is evenly split between men and women. I then told him that I believe gender is a social construct. If you believe that gender is a social construct, then you basically believe... And I can do it If I just believe it There's nothing to it I believe I can fly I believe I can touch the sky I think about it every night and day Spread my wings and fly I also told him that the only reason that women don't play and are discouraged is because the game itself is patriarchal. Kings are the highest, queens are lower. That is discrimination and discouraging women. The only solution is to make a king, queen, and gender fluid person and have them all be the same rank. This might change the rules, but I have to admit that I don't even know what they are. I'm not even a fan of poker. Except I'm doing video games. So it's not exactly a fandom. I'm not a fan of video games. I just want to change the rules and the whole culture of something even though I don't like it. I also didn't even bother asking female poker players their opinions because they're irrelevant. I know what's best for them. My brother also told me the rule changes would mess up the game. It would cause way too many ties and it wouldn't allow you to get straights. But some things need to be changed in the name of progress. So then, my brother and I, we played poker, and he took all my money. This is only because he has white, cisgender, heterosexual, able-bodied male privilege, and is part of the capitalistic patriarchy, which is exactly what this game represents. Throughout the video, I made some great points about feminism and social justice and why it's needed. Some of you basketball fans might even call the points I made... for justice. Come on and slam, and welcome to the jail. Come on and slam, if you want to jail. Hey, yo, what you gonna do? 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 Hey, yo, what you gon
your mind, can't get a thing in the overtime. Hey, DJ, turn it up. You see, D, go burn it up. Come on, y'all, get on the bus. So, hey, let's go. Hey, ladies.